Hi friends, in this series of IV fluids, today I will discuss dextrose 5%. First is the disclaimer, Caring Dogs YouTube channel does not provide medical advice and the information available on this channel does not offer diagnosis or advice regarding the treatment. Information provided by the channel is for educational purpose only and the information provided here is not to be used as an alternative to healthcare professionals diagnosis or treatment of any person or animal. Please seek the help of medical expert for the diagnosis and prevention and treatment of the medical illness. There is no endorsement for any brand or the company. Dextrose 5% Its composition is uh, 1 liter of the fluid contains 50 gram of glucose. 5% dextrose It corrects the dehydration and supplies the energy. After consumption of the glucose the remaining water is distributed in all compartments of the body proportionately. Therefore, dextrose 5% is the best agent to correct the intracellular dehydration. It is usually selected when there is need for water and not the electrolytes. 5% dextrose provides 170 kilocalories per liter and 1 gram of hydrous dextrose supplies 3.4 kilocalories. The indication for the use of 5% dextrose are it is widely used fluid for the prevention and treatment of the dehydration which is due to inadequate water intake or excessive water loss. It is the cheapest fluid to provide the adequate calories to the body. It is used both in pre and post operative fluid replacement. It is also used as a carrier for IV administration of various drugs. It is also used for the treatment and the prevention of the ketosis in starvation, diarrhea, vomiting and high grade fever. When it is used adequately, it can protect the liver against toxic substances. It is also used for the correction of the hypernatremia due to pure water loss for example in diabetes insipidus. The hypernatremia due to salt poisoning or excessive use of electrolytes needs infusion of 5% dextrose with frosamide to promote the excretion of the sodium and the correction of the hypernatremia. Various contraindications for the use of dextrose 5% are cerebral edema because it is hypotonic in nature. The hypotonic nature of the 5% dextrose can aggravate the cerebral edema. In all the neurosurgical procedure, 5% dextrose should not be used or it should be avoided because it increases the intracranial pressure and can cause damage during the neurosurgery, so it should be avoided. In patients with acute ischemic stroke, the glucose con containing fluid should not be used after any acute ischemic stroke as hyperglycemia can aggravate cerebral ischemic brain damage. In patients with hypovolemic shock, 5% dextrose is not the right fluid to be selected because it does not increase the intravascular volume. Moreover, the fast replacement by the large volume of dextrose 5% can lead to hyperglycemia and osmotic diuresis which can lead to increased urine output so the correction of the dehydration will be delayed. Hyponatremia and water intoxication in all patients in whom there is hyponatremia or water intoxication, we should avoid 5% dextrose because it will worsen both the conditions. Also in hypernatremia, the rapid correction should be avoided with 5% dextrose because first infusion of 5% dextrose when given rapidly, it corrects the severe hypernatremia but this, will, this correction occurs slowly in brain cell and so swelling of the hypertonic, hypertonic brain cell occurs and this may lead to serious or permanent neurological damage. Moreover, the rapid infusion of the dextrose also induces the osmotic diuresis which can aggravate hypernatremia. Therefore, the correction of the hypernatremia should be done gradually with dextrose 5% or with low sodium containing fluids. 
whenever we are giving blood transfusion to any patient the dextrose solution and the whole blood should not be administered through the same iv line as it can leads to hemolysis and the clumping of the clumping of the cells can occur dextrose 5% of course it should not be used in uncontrolled diabetes and severe hyperglycemia some precautions which we should take while administering the 5% dextrose we know that iv administration of the dextrose can cause local pain vein irritation and thrombophlebitis prolonged iv administration of 5% dextrose can also cause hypokalemia hypomagnesemia and hypophosphatemia it is usually administered at a rate of 0.5 g per kg body weight per hour and when it is administered at this rate it will not cause glycosuria this is all about the dextrose 5% albert einstein had said that intellectual growth should commence at birth and cease only at death thank you deep learning thank you once again